All right, so it's funny how, you know, you, you ask the quarter and other simple, stupid, mundane shits, the nigga will answer you. When you ask him some serious shit, the nigga won't answer you. Or if it's something that he doesn't care about, he won't answer you. I, I've been, yeah, kind of spamming him one question because he, everybody's talking about this for the house, but his shit keeps popping up about it. Nobody else is really, just his. You know what I mean? Probably not looking at everybody else hard enough. Actually, Eric July did the same thing. I tried to say something to him, and it was the same thing. I did what I usually do. I watched his video and was like, you know what? Maybe you will talk about something else while talking, but it wasn't. So, yeah, do some random shit out there and yada, yada, yada. So, you know, the quartering does his usual thing. Oh, guys, what do you want me to do for videos today? Because for some reason, I can't comprehend that shit myself. I need to know what you guys know. So instead of doing it live, I'm going to do it once or twice a while. Unless he does. Again, these are the things I could be wrong about. Unless he's doing it live on fucking some other streaming shit or something. Or actually probably on thing too. Because I'm not a good fan. You know, I don't follow, I don't follow my favorite creators all the time. That's my fault. That is my fucking stupidity. So how do I know what the quartering is doing? If I'm not following him on YouTube, I doubt he has a Twitter, I mean a Twitch, or goes live. He rarely goes live, because you never see him do that shit, going live, or unless he's live with somebody else. The quarter in is never live. Jeremy's never took the quarter in live on YouTube of late. Anywho. So when he's not doing it there, he's doing it here. If he's not, if I don't see, if, if I'm, the knowledge of him doing it there, I don't know about it. You would think that, whatever. So I, he put it what out. What do you think? I said, yeah. What do you feel about those, those guys in um, South Carolina? Do you think they're gonna get off or not? Do you think it's gonna be some sort of racially injustice type shit? Dead silence. Dead. Just like Camilla Camilla Har- Camilla Harris, whatever the fuck that the 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 vice president's name is, asked her a question. She gave these motherfuckers it's some sort of dual fucking answer. Oh, yes, our systems are... Of course the systems are set to be fucking just. That's what they're there for. And then all we can do is wait for the outcome. That's what she said. <laughs> Not verbatim, but basically what she said. I'll judge it after the case. Basically like everybody else. No, but she, actually she's better than everybody else. She's going to wait till all this shit happens. Then judge it. Which is crazy because we have evidence of this. So she could have easily been like judged by which which way the freaking the prosecutions are going. And then being like, yeah, you never know. Like, shit, I hope that there's justice. But in the South, it's fucking crazy. <laughs> you know what I mean? That Even up in fucking day and they're, they're already right to this day still trying to fucking. Well, in Kenosha, they're already trying to fucking crucify a man. For no good reason, just because they can. God knows if they want to let this one slide now because of that one. And yeah, he could have said any fucking thing. Or, he, or like just like Camilla, he Jeremy could have said anything. It could have even been like, yeah, nah, we've really been following the case. Just could have been fucking real. So then it's like later on, he starts typing. He's still typing this other shit about the dude Kyle. To clown who won't show up after a find of a fellow ruin their lives. I'll be in Kenosha. He will be there. At Delia Pop, whatever the fuck his name is. You should stop by and talk to me. <sighs> whatever. So, Jeremy, no justice for black folks. Referring to the tweet prior, before. Notice how Jeremy didn't fucking respond. But this cock, this cocksucker would. You know, I'm I'm well not well-versed on the Red House fucking case. But I have been watching key fucking evidence and witnesses and the such. And watching a piss-poor fucking prosecutor... Trying to do a job that the FBI did not want. So, yeah, I mean, I'm caught up on current events. I'm asking Jeremy something different. Which point, it's a good thing I'm not talking about, Kyle. Thanks for the info. Probably shouldn't have called him stupid. Probably shouldn't have called him stupid. You must have been. Because only sad, depressed troll would ask this kind, of, that kind of context question. What? Out of context question? Do it again. If Jeremy's, Jeremy's seen my fucking profile shit, he must, if, if he's, if he's, he must be a little conscious of me. <laughs> he must be. Because I do type stupid shit towards his way. 
or more time than most. But whatever. I guess this guy again knows everything about Jeremy. Knows everything about Jeremy. So I mean, I even I kind of reposted. Oh yeah, thanks Jeremy. Yada yada yada. Is this you? And then all of a sudden he's on some mode. Ah, I'm not Jeremy. <sighs> because there's another trial going on. My fault. I did go trial going on. You know, you know, right? When Jeremy da 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 da, you asked in the wrong place. How the fuck did I ask in the wrong place? Unless I'm taking him going to Kenosha for a different reason. I wonder what the significance of Kenosha is that Jeremy would be there. Or is he always boasting um thing? I told you I'm a shitty fan. I must be the worst fan in the world. I didn't know that Kenosha I didn't even know fucking Milwaukee was in Wisconsin. Let's we'll even get that thing. And you know, one of Jeremy's other followers corrected me and I had no problem with it. <laughs> no problem with that at all. That's why I'm asking about a whole totally different situation on the other thing. I'm not going to sit here and re rehash my every fucking thing. He could even ask me what I was talking about if he cared so much. But Jeremy didn't care. Didn't care at all. He would answer other stupid questions that I did that will ask him. Or if I say something remotely a little bit silly, he'll have the nerve. to. F That's what's funny about all these, these little commentators. You ask them something ser serious as, I guess, quote unquote, a deterrent, a deterrent. But it's like, nah, dude, you, you can't have fucking one. You, unless that, that you live in an echo chamber. The, the same shit that you guys talk about the left being bad for is what you're doing. It's a fucking echo chamber. And notice how everybody's sitting there just agreeing with it for no good reason. We agree with shit with no, for no good reason. No good reason. Didn't see any of the other tweets that I've been sitting there tweeting at this dude. But we'll focus on this one because black folks equals, again, I guess, Kyle being a... a yeah, racism with Kyle. No, that shit has nothing to do with racism. Nothing at all. We all know that. We've been watching the tapes. I mean, yeah, again, but I guess we got to go on everybody being slow. No, Nobody's watching cases. Must have been because you said, nah, because there's another case, there's another trial going on, you know, right? When Jeremy asked what video I should make, I asked him a question. Then you replied, then replied to this tweet. You're sucking dick right now. Real hard. Real hard. You're coming to a defense of somebody who doesn't want to come to defense for that shit. Even when you ask them serious like questions. If I asked them a stupid ass question or even implied that fucking Kyle was racist. Like directly. Then he probably would have said something. But I didn't. Because I bet you in, 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 in this dude's fucking twisted mind. Unconscious mind. He's seen some of the tweets that I have tweeted, and I've been on the side of Kyle this whole time on some old, this case is stupid. It's the dumbest case that I, I, I've been in trials where it's like, dude, the, 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 the prosecution has no fucking evidence to the contrary of what they did. But they will push fucking hard just to get a fucking, just to get a conviction, which is not right, which is not right at all. You ask in the wrong place. You ask questions whenever you ask questions. What am I going to go back to that same question? But he probably... Which, which, which he, he tweets from the toilet, if I'm not mistaken, and he just throws tweets away. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> How so? Made a political statement to a political commentator. Eh. I, f I just read that, you know, statements can't be questions. So I probably should have put a period there, huh? Whatever. I'm always asking questions that seem like statements, but yeah. But this guy, he just just want to just 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 wants to keep on going on about it. You said you asked a question. Now that you say you had a political statement, oh dear, sweet sweet little troll. Nah, nigga, you ask questions to fucking get the engagement of something. If I was trolling them, I would be saying something about fucking unicorns or dragons or fucking why don't fish talk to people anymore or stupid shit like that. That would be simple trolling. Right now, I'm asking a serious question. There's two there's two politically charged fucking cases going on right now. But only the media is really focused on one. On fucking one. Unless, you know, my YouTube algorithm is only feeding me one thing. <laughs> That's the only thing that I can think of. The only thing I can think of. Hence the reason why I'm asking somebody else who does political news why they wouldn't be covering something where the shit the things are the same. They're always trying to make similarities and shit. These things are two similar things. People chasing somebody. People getting shot. It just happens so that one person 
shot everybody in clear self-defense. Trying to be made out to be an active shooter that runs. Those are the type of active shooters I want in my schools. Active shooters that run away from you and don't even shoot you until you, att- until you approach and attack them. And what this dude saying is perceived as a threat of a, a fucking small little pit bull fucking barking at you. Or or a fucking small Rottweiler or something like that. Or a vicious dog. We'll just say a vicious dog because we those ain't fucking thing. When vicious little vicious dogs come up and keep yapping at you and you keep fucking walking away from them and then you're supposed to be mad for that. You're supposed to be fucking punished for whatever, whatever. So this dude's going to keep going like, who's the real troll? Who is the real troll here? Did someone who's just going to be like, all right, well, shit, then you don't want to answer you. You should probably leave it alone. And it's like, all right, well, then you don't really care about fucking justice or politics like that. It's only the ones that really everybody else cares about. Mob justice and all, you know? You know that you're you're a sad, desperate troll, huh? Who can't properly bait somebody. Who the fuck is trying to bait anybody? Who the fuck is trying to bait anyone? If I wanted to call Jeremy racist, I'd call him racist right to his face. And I would tell him why. I would tell him exactly why. And if you'd be like, oh, I'm not racist, I'd be like, you're a fucking liar. Everybody's racist. We are all a little bit bigoted in our own way. You know what I mean? It might be towards, I've seen fucking uh, some Asians be racist towards other Asian, Asians. I, I don't understand what the fuck you're saying. Well, I've, yeah, I'll say it like that, I guess. I've seen some Latin people, oh, I've heard, I've never seen it, but I've heard some Latin people are prejudiced against other Latin people. <laughs> Racism is funny that way. But yeah, all right. How am I trying to bait him? Who knows? I'm trying to get. I'm trying to gauge where his fucking political line is. I guess he is full alt right. Don't care about fucking justice unless it's for innocent white folks. But whatever, doesn't matter. I'm sure one day you'll earn your Twitter troll badge, but it's not this day. I didn't know that was a thing. I didn't even know you could get badges and fucking on Twitter. So it is something like Snapchat, where if you fucking dick around long enough, you can get what? I'm guessing the blue check mark is. How come Jeremy doesn't have a blue check? I know he's been trolling on fucking Twitter for God knows how long. You're a clown, dude. Jolly. Jolly. And it's funny because he went straight to my page to oh, do the senpai thing. Oh, he must be an anime thing. Let me use one of his, these words. Maybe it'll fucking do something. Fucking no, dude. It still doesn't deter from the fucking fact. Does he care if those other guys get off? Or, or how is he going to spin that narrative? Should they have not been burnt or buried underneath the jail? Or should or is the justice system, you know, in the right there? Is he going to play a is he going to play a fucking MSNBC fucking Nancy Drew shit? Oh, well, you know, the the the, 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 the courts for the, the justice system is what the justice system does. But yet now while we're watching the Ritter House shit, it's okay for them to do what he does. Be, don't be this guy, people. If, if 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 you were asking somebody else a direct question, you know what I mean, and somebody and not like I guess you don't make a statement, even though I think I feel I felt like I made a statement. But you, questions ain't statements. Questions are not statements. Don't be like this guy. If you directing something to somebody else and people like this answer to you, don't engage. Just be like I wasn't talking to you. What do you say, Jeremy? Or what do you say, so and so? Or what do you you know what I mean? Because this guy has no like he this dude has no legs, no legs at all. You know, his whiskey's only like fucking thirty two percent. No legs. When you when you pour your glass around and look at your your whiskey shot shit, yo, you're like yo, wait a minute, this is pretty. This is this is weak. This is no mud at all. So yeah, I, I guess. Jolly fucking wins the day. Good talk, I guess. And only assholes try to bait people. That's how I feel. Why would I stoop to your level? And I'll admit, minute when I'm wrong, that's how you solve problems, exactly. I'm not going to sit there and try to be like, oh, yeah, I'm right, I'm right, I'm right all the time. Whatever. It seems even sadder, yeah. You just like, to- you just like talking for people. Uh, I guess I said like. <laughs> just like talking. Oh, wait, yo, no, you just like talking for other people, which seems even sadder. Yes. Yes, it does. Especially if Jeremy's not willing to put his two cents into it. Why the fuck do I care what this cocksucker says? 
makes no fucking sense, dog. So like I said before, yeah, no justice for black people is what Jeremy, now I'll speak for Jeremy from what I'm gathering. No justice for black people. And, and this guy just, you know, thinks that the world is a troll when you ask fucking other other simple questions. Not my fault. It's almost like the thing. It's not my fucking fault for you to understand me. <laughs> you know what I mean? No, it's not my fault that you don't understand me or even understood the whole fucking interaction of just what was going on here. You were like a child just walking into a conversation, Donnie. You feel me, Donnie? You just can't come in here and fucking just jump into a conversation halfway and be like, oh, you could have been like, oh, what the... I don't know what to do. I'm just being stupid right now. Holy fucking shit, man. The world. The fucking world is a burning place. Try to be safe out there.